Okay, uh, Brian says, I'm building out location pages for a client that is service area business operating nationally in all cities, despite their head office being in one city. I have organization schema on the homepage for the brand. What would it be a good idea to add local business schema to all location pages alongside service schema, or is this a bad idea? I've seen a competitor in a search do this, but not sure if it's wise to follow suit. Um, okay. Yes, organization schema should be on the homepage without a doubt, okay? Um, for every location page, yeah, I recommend local business schema for those. Um, and then typically there's going to be like a separate page on the site or pages on the site that talk about the services available. Like it could be a separate service page for each service or one service page that covers all of the services. And yeah, so for the service page, not location page, but the service page, that should have service schema, right? Or a service type schema on it. And then for your, lo your location pages, local business schema. Now, on your location pages, they can reference, and it should reference the service page, right? The services offered, which would reference the service schema. And then it should also reference the organization as the parent organization of the local business schema. Does that make sense? So that's what's called connected data items or nested schemas, another term. There's a number of terms for it, but connected data items, nested schema. Um, Rob Beal has a great course, um, Schema Tech Architecture, on, on how to build all this stuff out. And I know Rob and Marco are, re, they, it's in beta right now, but a um, schema app that will, like essentially a um, you know SaaS app that will produce schema for you because his con his course is about like, he has a bunch of templates in there, but it's all manually drafted schema. Um, and personally, I don't have the desire to, 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 to go through doing it manually. Uh, although it's, it's very, very effective. He's got the most comprehensive schema training that I've ever seen as Rob's there's no doubt. He's a complete data nerd when it comes to that. And it's awesome. In fact, um, I mean, it's, it's inspiring <laughs> to see how he, he codes schema and how deep he gets into that stuff. And he calls it node referencing and all that kind of stuff. So what I'm getting at is, yes, it does make sense, but you have to connect the schema properly, uh, Brian, because if you don't, here's what I've seen people make mistakes. And I used to do this several years ago as well. I would put organization schema site-wide. So it would be like, you know, the JSON-LD would be in the HTML header globally, right? So site-wide. And then I would have on location pages, local business schema. Well, then it's two separate sets of schema on the location pages. And if you run it through the schema, uh, you know, validation tool, it would come up with set two separate pieces of schema on the page. And then it starts to ambiguate whatever the main entity of the page is, right? If it's got two separate sets of schema on the page that aren't connected properly, then which one is the main entity of the page? Google has to determine that instead of you telling it what the main entity of the page is, which is what we should be doing. That's what Scheme is about, is us feeding the bot the information that we want the bot to know, right? So I was doing it wrong, and I didn't realize that until um, really Rob's training at Kofu Live 2020, so uh, over a year ago now. Uh, and that's what really, like, again, it was inspiring. It inspired me to really get back into doing SEO, like really deep again and all that. And, it's, and that's where I started learning about connected data items or nested schema, whatever you want to call it. And so now, like I said, I, I do what we were just talking about, like a, for multi-location businesses, which I have a few of them that I, I manage. Um, I have organization schema on the homepage. We have service page or pages. Each one of those are marked up with service schema. Then we have location pages, which is local business schema, but in every one of the local business, well, okay. So on the service page, it references the organization. And on the local business pages, the location pages, it references its local business schema as the main entity of the page but it references the parent organization, organization schema, and it references the service provided, right? Does that make sense? Which would be the service schema. So that's, uh, again, that's kind of what Rob describes in his training. So I would encourage you to check that out. Um, and yes, Brian, I think that's a be the best strategy for schema for what you're talking about, your, your specific project. But you have, to, again, you have to connect those items properly or else you ambiguate the main entity of each one of those pages. So hopefully that makes sense. Good question as well.